Hey, my loves. Hey, hey, it's Lorraine Purcell. How are you? I'm so happy to be here with you this morning. I decided to take you on a walk with me. And I just um, got my Starbucks decaf put into my stainless mug rather than their cup because I just found out that the lids on Starbucks coffees are very, very to toxic. Uh, probably all, all um, you know, to-go cups, not just Starbucks. So I'm like, I'm just going to bring my own thing. So I think they gave me extra too. <laughs> So good morning. This is Body Talk Friday. Welcome, welcome, welcome. This is the day when we tap into our bodies and seek its wisdom because our bodies are so, so, so smart. Our bodies have all of our answers for us. So um, just a little bit going on here for more of my work, go to three keys to self love.com. Hi, Giselle. Good morning in the Philippines. How are you, darling? Um, go to three keys to self love.com. Three keys to self love.com. The number three backwards. I don't know which way three goes. Three. Yeah. Oh, it's not backwards. That's weird. So on my computer, it's backwards, but on my phone, it's not. That's very interesting. Three keys like you put in your car to selflove.com. Get my free ebook. It'll get us connected. So you get my uplifting emails, announcements about these three free live streams that I do every week. I'm all about your upliftment and letting you know you do not have to be depressed and sad and lonely and all that stuff. We can notice the feelings, but then it's a choice after that. And I show you step-by-step step through all of my live streams and all of my programs exactly how to do that. I cured myself of a lifetime of suicidal depression and have been free of it for the last six years. So I found the tools and techniques. And that's what I've been teaching my clients for the last, um, well, I've been working as a coach and a counselor for the last 23 years. Okay, so Giselle, let's try this. I am getting better. I am getting better. I am getting better. So would you write that, please, darling? Right, I am getting better. I am getting better. I am getting better, okay? Because your body is hearing not okay. All right? And trying is like, well, maybe if I feel like it. And this is the big trap that most of us fall into. Um, so I'm just coaxing you out of that, my love, because you know I love you. Say, I am getting better. I am getting better. Claim it, claim it, claim it. Those feelings are right there in your body for you to access. And feel how you would feel if you were getting better, Giselle. It's the secret. So I invite you to write that in the comments. I am getting better. Oh, and I just send you so much love, my dear. So let's tap into our bodies. Let's send down a grounding cord to Mother Earth. I am getting better. And the better it gets, the better it gets, the better it gets, the better it gets, the better it gets. We're going in the upward spiral up to the rarefied air where Earth angels belong, up above the atmosphere where you're floating weightless. This is where we belong. If we're down in the dense energy, uh, it's not good for us. The dense energy of the planet, listening to the news, the oh, ain't it awfuls. If there's anybody in your life who's draining you, politely say, I need to go now. And that's one of the keys in the three keys to self-love is love yourself enough to walk away. So, um, rarefied air, we're going in the upward spiral. You do not belong down here feeling bad. You belong up here feeling fantastic because it's right here for you. I don't care who you are or what your situation is. It's here for you. And I know because I've been through all of it. So, send down a grounding cord to Mother Earth and see what her sacred message is to you today. I am getting better, I'm getting better, yes. So Giselle, first of all, I acknowledge you for doing that. And second of all, 
I want you to say that one million times today. I am getting better. I am getting better. I am getting better. I am getting better. I am getting, especially when you feel really bad. I am getting better. I am getting better. I am getting better. I am getting better. And you will feel your energy start to go up and up and up and up and up. One of the tricks I used when I was in the the depths of just feeling like, oh my God, like my chest was just getting ripped open with emotional pain. Like, I'm so happy. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. I have a video on it on my YouTube channel if you want to check it out. Um, all you have to do is say, I'm so happy. 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 And only like you can say it three times, your smile starts to happen. It's all our mind. Okay, listen to this. We have 60 trillion cells in our body. Six zero trillion. I don't know how many zeros that is, but it's a pretty damn much. 60 trillion cells in our body and every single cell, listen to this, produces 100,000 chemicals every minute. Every one of those 60 trillion cells is producing 100,000 chemicals per minute. All it's doing is waiting for you with your mind and your thoughts to say, Vicki, to say, and Vicki will verify to say what kind of chemicals you want it to make. Do you want it to make, I'm so sad, I'm so depressed, oh my God, my life sucks. I hope I just die pretty soon because I can't take this anymore. Or do you want it to produce chemicals that are like, I'm so happy, I'm so happy, I'm getting better and better and better and better and better. The better it gets, the better it gets. And Vicki is the poster child for this. She's been practicing my stuff for a year and a half now, a year now, Vicki. And she's curing herself of a chronic disease right now just because she's applying probably this secret more than anything else. Right, Vickster? And I'm so proud of you. Mm. She couldn't even go for a walk. And now she's talking about getting in her garden. Things are turning around for her. Yay, Vicki! So I'm so happy. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. It will change everything. You have to start there. Universe will not give you something that you're not already putting out. It's not the way it works. The way it works is you have to put out what you want first for universe to meet you and give it to you. We can't just sit around like, like Java the Huds going, okay, just feed me, just feed me universe. And then I'll respond. It's like, no fucking way. That's not the way it's going to happen. We have to put in our energy to make universe respond to us. Well, actually, if we're going, I'm so sad. That's energy. The universe say, oh, you like that? Okay, we'll give you more. <laughs> I know this to be true. You can trust me. So, oh my golly. Mother Earth. What's Mother Earth saying to you? She's just verifying yes. Yes, 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 yes. Ah, let's stand up, move our hips. Honesty, I had the feeling I'd see you this morning. Stand up and yeah, let's go crazy. Listen to some good music. Put on Prince, let's go crazy. Listen to his words. Those words are amazing. Okay, so stand up, move our hips. <laughs> Honesty's in the house. Whoop, whoop. Stand up, move our hips. This is our declaration. Big circle. I'm taking up my space. I'm taking up space. Yeah, happy, happy, happy. Moving your hips, moving your hips. And it's going to feel like a bullshit job for a while, but you know what? It really works. What's the alternative? What's the alternative? You staying sad, getting sicker and sicker. The thing is, you're, you're not going to die very easily. And so you're just going to be laying there miserable. You might as well have a great life while you're figuring it out. And your life is getting better and better and better and better and better. So swing those hips and make that declaration. Got this guy in the parking lot looking at me. <laughs> like, ooh, what's that? <laughs> Making this declaration. I'm taking up space. 
I'm being 100% me. I'm doing, like, nobody owns me. You're not the boss of me. Nobody owns me. I'm taking my space. This is what swinging your hips in a big circle is all about, especially for women. Okay? And I know I've got some male earth angels that are joining me, and I'm just so happy. Oh, shout out to Doug and to uh, Troy. Wow, that's interesting. I mean, David and Troy. <laughs> Sorry, forgive me. Um... It's going to be a great fucking day. Yes. Yes. So see that? Giselle, take a lesson. You're not alone. I've been through it. And you, you coming out and letting me coach you through this, Giselle, is just verifying for everybody. Okay, so now let's come back up to our feet. We're going to go through our whole body with a counterclockwise upward spiral of white light. Just... <laughs> aligning all that space. We are 99.9999999% space, energy. This is only a figment of your imagination. Another Earth saying to enjoy your happiness. Yes, and you deserve it, Vixter. So Vicky is an example of someone who does what it takes until it takes. She stayed the course. She stayed the course. And Vicky, was it hard sometimes? Were you scared sometimes? Were you worried sometimes that it wasn't going to work? I'm so excited, you guys. Find something to get excited about today. As you're going through your path, always do the next thing that seems like it's really fun and really enjoyable and that lights up in the path. So all that space, we're going to send light and love to that 99.9999% energy. We're going to send light and love to it, light and love to it, light and love to it. And every single cell is getting cleansed and they're happy, smiley faces populate. Like every single one of your cells is a smiley face. So let's just see that as we're coming up, coming up, coming up, coming up, coming up, coming up. Ah. And as you're coming up, You'll notice some owie spots. Just consult them. Your, your body will tell you. What are you trying to say to me, Mother Earth? What are you trying to say to me, this spot? I've got um, my right hips a little cricky and my low back is kind of tight. I was doing some deep stretching in bed. I actually put myself in traction in the mornings. And that kind of activates a little pain. But I'd rather do that because I'm opening up my, my spinal column. So I'm just feeling into it. My right hip is saying, let go, let go. Oh, just saying that, I could feel my whole shoulders just relax. And my lower back is saying to trust. What's your body saying to you? I want to know. Sorry, I got a post nasal drip this morning. I'm going, sorry, forgive me. So what's your body saying to you? I want to know. Drop it in the comments. Ah, it is going to be a great day. And if your day is already passed, like I have no idea what time it is in the Philippines, or those of you watching the replay, um, look back and only focus on the things that were wonderful in your day today. Only the things that were wonderful in your day today. Woo! We've got this, guys. <clears throat> Depression is a choice. Only 10% of our body is dictated by DNA and genes. Only 10%. Like if you go, cancer runs in my family, so I'll probably get cancer. It's like, fuck that. Everything is your choice. There's only 10% that's even a proclivity toward that. Don't pay attention to that. <clears throat> yeah, Vicky still has days, but she pushes through. That's what we do. And you push through by finding pleasure, finding the next wonderful thing. What would be the next fun thing to do? What would be the next fun thing to do? This morning when I got up, I was like, I feel like walking to Starbucks. Could I do the, yeah, they put in this new little courtyard here. Yes, I could do this. So 
here I am because it sounded like fun. Not to just sit in my living room again, right? So what's your body saying? What do you want this day to be like? Can somebody tell me what time it is? I have a video call with my Get Happy, Stay Happy girls in, at 9 o'clock, the top of the hour. I'd have to get off of this to check my time. Can somebody tell me what time it is? Vixter, you're in my time zone. If you could do that, that would be awesome. <laughs> or I could just dart off and then be right back. Okay, great. We've got 10 more minutes. What do you want this day to be like? What do you want this day to be like? If it's already night, what do you want tomorrow to be like? Go there. Go there right now. Oh, great, Vicki. So what do you want this day to be like? What do you want tomorrow to be like if it's already night for you? Turn off the television. Stop watching the news. Stop letting everybody else's shit smear all over you. Stay focused on your own happiness. Nothing is more important than that you feel good. Whatever it takes for you to feel good, this is the key. Um, for a while, you'll get some pushback saying that's selfish. And you just say, yes, it is selfish maybe, but this is what I'm doing. You are no use to anybody when you're sad and in the dumpster. Right, Giselle? Could you lift anybody up right now? No. It's time. It's time for us to own our power. I'm on my way to be superhuman. In fact, I got a vision the beginning of this week where I was looking out through uh, like transformer eyes. I was like, I could see like the plastic. I was in there and I was, or whatever it is, and I could see through the eye sockets and it was telling me exactly who to talk to and exactly what movements to take to be the most efficient. Listening to the body and soul go with the flow. Yep. Oh, my reception for you is better when you're outside. Wow. Interesting. Because I've had other people say, oh, we're losing you. We're losing you. Probably because I'm. Oh, I'm really close to a cell tower right now. That's why. So what do we want our day to be like? I want mine to be magical. I'm going to write that in there. I, I'm going to say my day is magical. Day is magical. What kind of day do you want your day to be? Ah. And we have to completely unplug from familial conditioning. That's why, especially in the beginning when you're doing this stuff, you need to not be around the people you've been around. Um, my neighbor had an ambulance called for her this morning. And they're like, yeah, she has congestive heart failure and she has sleep apnea. And I was talking to her the other day about stretching. She can hardly move. And um, I could just hear, I was just reading in the energy as her kids were telling me this morning that she was in the ambulance. People, people come to expect this to happen. I want you to hear me. People full of fun surprises and laughing. Very good, Vicki. People come to expect this kind of stuff to happen to their bodies because it's what my mom had, it's what everyone around me is having. Get away from those people. Send them love, but get away from them because you will catch it. That's why the people in the, um, the medical fields, they're almost sunk. Because they're around this bullshit all the time when it's not even real. And if you have conditions, you probably want to throw your phone at me right now. But just get out of it. This is the way. I am not kidding you. It's quantum physics. It's no longer Newtonian. Newtonian, where you do X, you get Y. Yeah. 
So, right. I probably have it too. Because <laughs> I know I know when I'm listening to myself sleep, sometimes I have recordings going, then it stops, and then I go, I can hear that. It's okay. I have to run my oxygen through it. Yeah. So imagine yourself, like you've been doing, Vicki, your body completely restoring yourself, you know, completely restoring. My, I got this. I got this. I got this. I got this. We are, we have what we allow. We have what we're available for. Oh, yes. So what else do you want for your day? What do you name and claim for yourself? I claim 100% health. I, I claim 100% flexibility. I claim 100% happiness. I claim 100% being tapped into spirit and source. I claim 100% that I always do the right thing, that I always make the right decisions, that everything always works out for me. Yet the better it gets, the better it gets, the better it gets. I accept nothing less. It's time to get our big girl panties on, our big boy pants on. Let's go. Being out of the mold has improved my health. I claim making the best day of each day, the best of each day. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, my loves. Oh, and what does your body need to restore over the weekend? Mine, I see a picture of me leaping and frolicking on this on the sand. And now let's do it. Let's obey. Let's obey our bodies. What is it telling you to do that it needs over the weekend to restore and regenerate? Yep. Weightlessness. Weightlessness. I have two little dogs that walk up my sidewalk wanting belly rubs from Aunt Vixter. Oh, how cute. Very good. Okay, loves, this has been a blast. I love you so much. For more of my work, go to www.3keys2selflove.com. The number three keys like you put in your car, to selflovecom I'm going to drop it in here. Dub, dub, dub. Wrong. Oops, I did it again. Dub, dub. Three keys to self and you'll get so much revelation from that self love it's a three truths that were downloaded to me five years ago and I still use them to this day I just used it yesterday with my clients three keys to selflove.com go there get my free ebook Whatever it tells me, and have a great weekend. Yes. Okay, loves. I'll see you Monday for Fairy Godmother Monday at 8.30, same time here, 8.30 a.m. Eastern. And then the Wednesday Earth Angel Empowerment Training is uh, an hour earlier now. It's at 6 p.m. on Wednesdays, Eastern. So get on my email list so you can get the announcements. They, the, say, 30 minutes or an hour for the Wednesday training. Okay, love you. Thanks for being with me this morning. I love you, love you, love you. Bye. Yeah, awesome. Nothing like music to get you excited, Giselle. Get some great music and start jumping around. <laughs>